My name is Yaron Avisar. I'm a social worker and in the past 20 years I specialize in uh, drug and alcohol rehabilitation. Uh, I work here for the Phoenix House uh, in the past five years and uh, I conduct uh, intakes, uh, group therapy and uh, in some cases uh, individual sessions. Um, here at the Phoenix House, uh, what we do is a, a complete program of uh, rehabilitation that uh, begins with the detox, but it's important to say that the detox is only the first and should never be the last phase of the rehabilitation process. Um, uh, our place is called the Phoenix House uh, after the name of the legendary bird that uh, rose back to life uh, from ashes. And uh, for us, this is the symbol of an addict that managed to uh, recover uh, his life. Uh, we work in, in full collaboration, uh, all the staff of this house that uh, includes um, uh, uh, instructors that uh, were addicts themselves and therefore they know um, the situation as best as anyone. Uh, there is a, a psychiatrist, there is a doctor, and there's also a special therapists like uh, myself and others. Um, uh, the process is aimed uh, for the purpose of uh, turning um, addicts into uh, fully independent people. And for this pur uh, purpose, uh, we uh, put a special emphasis on uh, the group therapy with the understanding that they are the ones who could help each other best as they can. Uh, there is always the option that uh, when they go back to the States, once they are done their treatment here in Israel, they will continue in uh, some kind of uh, group support that uh, we uh, are handling over there back in the States. Uh, I think there is a great advantage in the fact that uh, one can uh, move all the way from the States into Israel for the therapeutic process because of the detachment and the distance from the world and life that he leaves behind, so that once he goes back after a period of uh, rehabilitation process, uh, he will uh, have enough um, uh, strength and um, tools so that he can uh, maintain his uh, sobriety for the duration.